Welcome back, everyone. Well, Carmen and Lauren from Fascist Chocolates are here to tell us a little bit about a fun event that's coming up. Um, it's called Connecticut Open House Day. Uh, tell us a little bit about, this is a really cool event that's happening. Yeah, so we're gonna be having a lot of different activities coming up this Saturday, June 8th from 10 to 5 p.m. And basically, one of the things that we'll be offering is actually a, um, a free um, chocolate experience at cool. 12, 2, and 4. So people can come in and uh, just learn a little bit about chocolate. Um, and then we'll also be offering the opportunity to make your own chocolate bar, actually. Mm -hmm. And that's going to be just $7. So uh, that'll be a pretty exciting activity. Um, we'll also be welcoming people from the um, who have come from the Thompson train station. Uh -huh. um, that's in partnership with the uh, Railroad and Museum of New England. So we're really excited to welcome those people. And on um, at our uh, store, we'll be having um, different artisans and vendors outside, uh, one of which is the Pasta Heaven food truck, which I'm very excited about. Nice! And uh, yeah, different activities for the kids, a DJ, so it should be a fun day. We're and really I've been to your it. place before, it is so fun because their education is a big mm -hmm. part of going to visit you guys. We do a lot there on site. We are yeah. a place to experience your chocolate. So we're a tourist destination, which is why we're part of the Department Open of Tourism, House. and this yeah. is a Connecticut open house day is a statewide thing uh, all the attractions that want to participate are offering certain things so you can go on to ctvisit.com by town and find out who's participating awesome. and and that's coming on saturday it's the end of a very busy week because as yeah. i mentioned to you we are hosting connecticut is the host site for the national chocolate convention wow. for our industry group <laughs> retail confectioners international now that's not something the public is too aware of right. we're going to be at the convention center all week but on friday we host all 160 chocolate Chocolatiers at our place. Wow. So we have a busy, busy, busy week, week going on guys, getting yeah. prepared. So is that sort of a, co a competitive thing? Are you, or, or is each have their own niche? And you know, everybody does have their own niche, and we all exist. Uh, but I will say that I've been in industry before I got into the chocolate world, and in the chocolate world, there is sharing like I've never experienced mm. before. Everyone's sweet to each other. So <laughs> absolutely. So Munson's <laughs> is a host site for a tour on Thursday. Uh -huh. We're a host site for a mm. tour. Thompson Chocolate in Meriden, who most people don't know because they they do a little bit different in the chocolate world uh -huh. but they're a host site so there's uh there'll be all the chocolatiers here so. and this is some of the stuff that you're showing the, off the theme right? the theme of the week is chocolate is art mm -hmm. so we have some artistic uh pedestals with some chocolates on them so roses pretty. and such um the lava cakes here though those yes. are something we're featuring at open house day so lauren why don't you tell us a little bit more about our lava cakes yes. and can i have a bite and of you it can, while please, you tell us about it lauren? On the inside. so mike go ahead and make a cut it open and show the inside because oh, that, that is looks a so lava. Yeah. good yeah. Yeah. so this is what people can try we usually um, are only offering these to wholesalers <laughs> but um, for Connecticut oh Open House Day we're doing um, lava cakes with or without gelato so it'll be a very tasty oh, treat so good <laughs> yeah we're not a service <laughs> counter meaning we don't have a cafe right but on this day we will be heating these up oh, these and are serving them with with cream or gelato and they are my sister-in-law is the baker we are a bakery as well as a gelateria as mm -hmm. well as a chocolate factory and then so you can bring some treats home and we can too. bring some treats home as well is that good? It's Incredible. A, yeah, it's wonderful. I don't even have words. I'm speechless. <laughs> so tell folks, just remind them when they can come out and visit you and where you're located. So Connecticut Open House Day is uh, Saturday, June 8th from 10 to 4. And we will be hosting some mini chocolate experiences. We are at 44 Chase River Road, easily accessible right off Route 8, two minutes north of 84 in Waterbury. And... Uh, Please go to ctvisit.com and check out what else is going on yeah. in the area because you can make a day of it. A sure. lot of fun Certainly a day to discover what's in your backyard. Yeah, it's amazing. Tell us a little bit about the weather today because we do have a weather alert before we go. <laughs> All I think about this is that I know. So now we're totally distracted. Um, uh, we are under an early warning weather alert. Um, you can see here, this is our latest model run for about 3 o'clock. The reason why I, I have it here is this is about the point where we might start to see some stronger storms firing up. And so we will be watching this afternoon sky for maybe some, some strong gusty wind in addition to the rain and lightning. Now, most of us wouldn't see that wind concern. It would be a very isolated case. Um, but I just want to let you know that there could be a few warnings out there this afternoon, and we're going to be keeping eyes on it all day long. All right. Have a great day, everyone.